first venture into space, two American astronauts are poised and waiting to add a new dimension to space travel. John Young and Bob Crippen are in the cockpit of the Space Shuttle Columbia, ready to ride her into orbit and fly her back to Earth. The computer problem that scrubbed the shuttle's launch on Friday, all those problems have been resolved and the countdown is moving evenly toward a blast off about 20 minutes from now. This first true spaceship, not a capsule, leaves Earth exactly two decades after the Russian cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin in Vostok 1 became the first man to enter space and it leaves from the same launch pad, 39A, at the Kennedy Space Center from which Neil Armstrong in Apollo 11 left to put man's first step on the moon. This is a CBS News special report. in space, the first flight of the shuttle. This portion is sponsored by the Bell System, putting its knowledge to work for your business in the information age. And is Dan Rather. It's an absolutely beautiful day at the Kennedy Space Center. The weather is even better than the planners of this morning's launch had hoped for. The countdown has been proceeding uh, smoothly, every bit as smoothly as it was uh, on Friday morning when the launch was originally scheduled. You recall we got down to within uh, nine minutes of a possible launch on Friday morning before that computer problem developed. No sign of any computer problem uh, this morning. No sign of any hitch in the countdown at all. You can see uh, this uh, shot of, uh, with the sun low but coming up over the horizon. And one reason we wanted to show you that photograph is to indicate that uh, once uh, Columbia gets a lift off and gets up, uh, it may be a particularly good morning uh, to see the intros of the uh, space shot. Perhaps even better than was the case on Friday morning. There you see the countdown clock proceeding 17, 19, 18 seconds, counting on down. T-minus 40 seconds and counting. The development flight instrumentation recorders are on. T-minus 35 seconds. We're just a few seconds away from switching to the redundant sense sequencer. T-minus 27 seconds. We have gone for redundant set sequencer start. T-minus 20 seconds and counting. T-minus 15, 14, 13, T minus 10, 9, 9 8, 8, 7, 6, 6 5, 4. We've gone three, for main engine start. We have main engine start. Three, 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 America's first space shuttle. And the shuttle has cleared the tower. Columbia, you're in negative seats. 
As the spacecraft uh, reaches into orbit and uh, prepares for uh, to make its first uh, circular orbit of the Earth, we'll say that our CBS News coverage of the flight, and we can now say flight of spacecraft Columbia, will continue after this pause for station identification. <laughs> 